Hey, Psych2Goers, welcome back to another video. Are you worried about your bond with your partner? Do you feel like your relationship isn't as strong as it was before? Or are you still single and wanna learn how to build a strong relationship with your future partner? When you've been so accustomed to being around your partner after dating or being married for months to years on end, you may feel that a once solid connection has gone cold or stagnant. But worry not, because there are a number of ways to keep your relationship strong. And while many people may tell you that communication is key, and it is, here are some other, perhaps more specific ways to help strengthen your relationship between you and your partner. Number one, spend time together without being distracted by technology. Have you ever been to a restaurant with your partner but spent most of your time on your phones? It can happen to the best of us, whether it's scrolling through our Instagram feeds or checking our emails. It's no secret that we're beyond hooked on our smartphones. However, while the issue may seem harmless, the problem can add to relationship strain, particularly to married couples. A New York Times article from 2016 points out that while men and women are equally as attached to their devices, women in partnerships react more sensitively to it. Dr. Susan Heitler, author of Prescription Without Pills, noted that one of her clients, who was fearful that his partner was unfaithful to him, reacted to his anxiety by retreating further into his smartphone rather than facing the issue head on. So a good way to strengthen your relationship may be to make a conscious effort on the conversations in real time rather than the ones on your phone. Number two, ask your partner something new. When was the last time you asked your partner a deep thought provoking question? When you get so used to being around someone, it's common to think that you know everything there is to know about them. But the truth is human beings are ever evolving and there's usually more beneath the surface that could be revealed. According to the website Goalcast, open and honest conversations can further serve a couple by eliciting feelings of trust, understanding, and compassion. These conversations can allow you and your partner to have a clearer idea as to why the other thinks and behaves the way they do. It also gives each partner the opportunity to be empathetic and good listeners. Number three, look into each other's eyes more. Have you ever actively looked into your romantic partner's eyes? It's been shown that sustained eye contact meaning a few minutes or more, can foster feelings of intimacy, connectedness, and vulnerability. Even more powerfully, according to the website Mind and Spirit, looking into each other's eyes more can create the feeling of really being seen and acknowledged without distraction. While it may seem unlikely that the common couple with busy schedules would just take time out to stare at each other every day, the act alone of increasing eye contact in unsuspecting moments can have a transformative effect. Number four small acts of physical affection. How often do you show your partner physical affection? Finding small moments to touch your partner, a brush of each other's hands, a hug from behind, a kiss hello or goodbye are all ways to strengthen your bond with them. A 2003 study which surveyed 295 college students showed that there's a direct link between the amount of physical affection in a relationship to the overall relationship satisfaction. The correlation was simple. The more physical affection there was, the more satisfied couples were. And number five, cooking and eating together. Do you spend time with your partner in the kitchen? Cooking together can be an overlooked way to strengthen the bond with your partner because sometimes it can be logistically difficult to do. For example, you and your partner may come home from work at different times, but making a conscious effort to make a meal together can be the perfect opportunity for you both to share stories about your respective days to banter and simply work towards something together. And don't forget the playful splash from the faucet that always adds just a little bit more fun to the process. So what other ways have you tried to strengthen your relationship with your partner? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and share this video with those who might benefit from it. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell icon to get notified whenever Psych2Go posts a new video. The references and studies used in this video are added in the description below. Thanks for watching and see you in our next video.